Hello friends, it's another beautiful summer morning. I'm so glad you're here with me. Are you ready to taste and paint again? Are you ready? I know I'm ready. Hi friends, good morning. I'm ready. I am super, super excited to taste another fruit and paint it as well. Friends, what color is the fruit that we are going to paint today? Do you know? I'm going to reach over for mine. Let's look at it. Ooh, it's a lime. Does it smell sweet? Remember when we smelled the orange, friends? It had a really, really sweet smell. Well, so does the lime. Mmm, we're going to taste it. Ooh, this is going to be fun and exciting, right? Oh, yeah, definitely. I hope you're feeling great this morning. I hope you've had a beautiful morning or afternoon so far. And we are going to get started. I can't wait to sing, dance, stretch a little bit, right? We've been having a great time so far. Now that we're here, we are going to get started. I'm going to grab my trusty purple pointer. Let's begin. Good morning, boys and girls. Today is, let's look at the calendar, July 21st. Wow, friends, 21 days. 21st, 2021. A lot of 20s, right? It's the 21st, and we're in the year 2021. Isn't that cool, friends? Let's spell July together, and then we'll count from 1 all the way to 21. Are you ready? If you're ready, say, I'm ready, Miss Shannon. And let's begin. J-U-L-Y, July. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 18, 19, 20, 21. The last number that we counted to so far is 21. We started at one and friends, look, we've gone all the way to 21. And so now that we know that today is the 21st, what day is it? Is it a Friday? Is it Saturday? What day, friends, do you know? Did someone say today is Wednesday? Good job, friends. You got it. Wednesday begins with W. Can we say what what Wednesday together? Okay, W E D N E S D A Y. Wednesday. Let's put Wednesday on the board and sing. Today is Wednesday, today is Wednesday, all day long, all day long. Today is Wednesday, today is Wednesday, all day long, all day long. Today is Wednesday, happy, happy Wednesday, happy, happy Wednesday. All right, friends, now that we know today is Wednesday, what was yesterday? Do you know? Do you remember? Yesterday was Tuesday, and Tuesday begins with T, 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 Tuesday. Should we spell Tuesday together? T, U, E, S, D, A, Y, Tuesday. Let's put Tuesday on the board and sing. Today is Wednesday, yesterday was Tuesday. Today is Wednesday, yesterday was Tuesday. Today is Wednesday, happy, happy Wednesday. We made it to Wednesday. All right, friends, next up is what day? If today is Wednesday and yesterday was Tuesday, what will tomorrow be? What will tomorrow be, friends? Did someone say Thursday? If you said Thursday, you are correct. All right, friends. Now we're going to sing our days of the week. Are you ready? How many days are in a week? 
did one of my friends say seven? If you said seven, you are correct. Are you ready, friends? Days of the week. 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 There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. 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 All right, friends, these are the days of the week. There's seven. Now, how many months are in a year? Did someone say 12? If you said 12, you are correct. There are 12 months in a year, friends, and we are currently in which month? Are we in the month of July? We are in the month of July, friends, and let's sing. These are the months of the year. There's January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. These are the months of the year. I'm so excited, friends. These are the months of the year. There are 12 in all. We start at January and we go all the way to December. And we're currently in the seventh month, which is July. All right, friends, speaking of July in the season, is it summertime? Mm-hmm, Miss Shannon, it's summer, summer, summertime. And in the summer, the sun is out, right? Look here. We see the sun here up on our board, and we see the sun in this picture, a beautiful blue sky. And friends, do we have a lot of fun in the summer? Yeah, we usually do, right? Summer is nice and warm and we get to play. Look at these two little squirrels playing together. They're playing in water. Do you like to play in water? All right, let's talk about the weather. Today's weather, it's hot, Miss Shannon, right? It is hot because it's July and in July it's hot. And in Maryland, where Miss Shannon is, it's definitely hot. It's sunny, friends, and guess what? We get to go play baseball in the summer. Today, we're gonna to read a story about Pete the Cat and baseball. So how about we look at Mr. Dinosaur, who has a baseball, friends, look. And I took his sandals off, did you notice? Did you notice that? I took his sandals off because if he's playing baseball, friends, sandals won't be a good idea, right? We don't want Mr. Dinosaur to hurt his toes. Mm-hmm. But he definitely needs on his cap. And he definitely needs his sunglasses. Look, he's ready with his baseball. And he has on sneakers. Mr. Dinosaur is ready for a beautiful summer day to play baseball. Do you like playing baseball, friends? Have you ever played baseball before? All right. Well, we're going to read about it today with Pete the Cat. I'm excited for that. All right, friends, we are going to get to our song, right, to see who's here today. Now, I know you guys are here with me. And so I get to call on the girls and the boys, right? There's so many girls, so many boys. Who's here? Miss Shannon's here. You guys always help me. But first, I'm going to call on the girls. Or we can say the ladies. Hey, ladies, are you here today? If you are a girl and you are here, you're joining Miss Shannon, I want you to say, I'm here, Miss Shannon, and I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm r r r ready. Are you ready? Okay, girls up first. Are my girls here today? Are my girls here today? I jump up, down, and all around. My girls are here today. Hooray, they made it today. Hey, girls. Super moves. Next up, the boys. Boys, are you ready? And we can also say gentlemen. Gentlemen, are you ready? Let's start. Are my boys here today? Are my boys here today? I jump up, down, and all around. My boys are here today. Hooray, they made it today. All right.
right boys i'm so glad you're here my girls are here my boys are here now it's miss shannon's turn but i need your help i can't do it alone i need you to jump up and down and all around with me okay all right is miss shannon here today is miss shannon here today i jump up down and all around miss shannon is here today hooray i made it today i'm here today and i made it friends i'm so glad to be here with you okay we are going to sing a little song and do a little dance are you ready are you ready are you re 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 ready okay i want you to put your arms up 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 high high to the sky and wave them wave your arms give your arms some nice long stretches and wave your arms wave 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 one more time wave wave a wave wave and then bring them down and we're going to sing a little song that goes something like this open shut them open shut them give a little open shut them open shut them lay them in your lap 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 creep them crawl them creep them crawl them right up to your chin 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 open shut them open shut them one last thing but do not let them in oh friends don't let those creepy crawlers in let's sing about a spider are you ready the itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the itsy bitsy spider went up the spout again. Good job, friends. Okay, we're going to breathe in. <sighs> breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. One more time, breathe in, out. Give yourselves a big squeeze. Pretend it's Miss Shannon giving you a big, big squeeze. You are so awesome. You are so amazing, right? Okay, now grab a drink of water if you need to. And don't forget, give yourselves a hand clap and a pat on the back. You did a great job, friends. <laughs> All right, Miss Shannon needs her water before we read our story. Right? We get in our exercise, friends, and we're moving, so we definitely need to stay hydrated. Right, friends? Today's story is another Pete the Cat story. I'm excited. I like Pete the Cat. Do you like Pete the Cat, friends? All right, well, today we are going to read Pete the Cat Play Ball. Let's see what happens with Pete. Here comes Pete the Cat. Pete has a mitt. He has a bat and a ball. What will Pete do today? What will he do, friends? Pete will play baseball. Today is the big game. The Rocks are playing the roles. Pete and his team get set. They play catch. They take turns hitting. It's time to play ball. The Rocks bat first. Pete waits for his turn. Crack! The batter hits the ball. He runs to first base. Way to go, Pete cheers. Batter up, says the umpire. Pete goes up to bat. The pitcher throws the ball. Pete swings the bat. He misses the ball. Strike one. The pitcher pitches again. P 
Heat swings too high. Strike two. The pitcher winds up. He throws. Pete strikes out. But Pete is not sad. He did his best. Pete's friend Ben is up. Ben hits a home run. Way to go, cheers Pete. The rolls go up to bat. The rocks go to the field. Crack, here comes a fly ball. I've got it, calls Pete. The ball hits his mitt, but Pete drops it. He is not sad. He did his best. Another hit. This time Pete catches it, but he throws it too far. Pete is up at bat again. He wants to hit the ball. The first pitch is too low. Pete does not swing. Ball one. The next pitch is too high. Pete does not swing. Ball two. The third pitch is inside. The fourth pitch is outside. Pete gets four balls. Pete wanted to go get a hit, but a walk is cool too. The next batter gets a hit. Pete runs as fast as he can. Pete wants to score, but he is out at home plate. Pete is not sad. He did his best. The game is over. The Rocks win six to three. Way to go, calls Pete. Way to go. Cool. Good game, the Rocks say. Good game, the Rolls say. Pete did his best. We had fun. What a great game. That was a great game. Can you see all the cats in their uniform? Look at them, friends. Can you see their uniform? They all played together. Wasn't that cool? They also have red hats on. What else do you notice? Yep, I noticed that each of them have a number on their jersey, right? What numbers do you see? Do you see five, four, seven? Yep, I see those numbers too. I think they did great. Did you like this book, friends? All right, we are going to read one more story about Pete the Cat tomorrow as well. And I'm pretty excited about that. All right, friends, we have been talking about fruit, eating fruit this whole week, right? Every day together, we have tasted some type of fruit, right? Cherries, watermelon, an orange, right? Mm-hmm. It's been a great kiwi. Kiwi was my favorite, right? Do you remember the color of kiwi, friends? Yep, kiwi's green in the middle. It was fuzzy on the outside. Yep, brown and black seeds. It was really, really good. And I hope you continue to try these fruits at home. And today, friends, we get to try a lime. Oh my goodness, have you ever tried a lime before? Sm let's smell it, smell the lime, what do you think? Mmm, does it almost smell sour a little bit, right? <laughs> well, let's taste and see. Let's bite into the lime. Mmm. Whoa. <laughs> Tart, right, friends? Oh, my goodness. Woo. Look at that. When we bite into it, it's tangy, right? Super, super sour and sweet at the same time, right? If you have lime juice, mm. excuse me, friends, I took a big bite. <laughs> now Miss Shannon's eyes are watering. That happens with limes. Mm. But the taste is good. Now, you may like it or you may say, no way, Miss Shannon. 
Mm -mm -mm. I cannot do a line. Either way, I hope you tried, right? Okay, so let's put our lines away. Mm -hmm. And we are going to start to paint. I'm going to grab my easel, grab my paint, and we're going to have some fun painting, okay? Did you like that, friends? Was it good? Okay. All right, we have our lime. Ta-da. We have our lime. We are going to paint over the word lime. So if we look at the word lime, we see that it begins with an L. And an L makes the L sound, right? L, 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 like lion. And now we have a lime. And a lime is green, right? Let's take a look at it again. A lime is green on the outside and on the inside too. It's a little white if you cut it. You see that white strip right there, friends? Yep, and it's super, super sweet, sour, tangy, all at the same time, right? Mm. All right, friends, we are going to start. We're going to paint together. And first, I'm going to start at the top. I am just going to paint over the words. Okay. Lime. I'm going to clean my paintbrush. I have green paint. And we are going to paint the word lime. Right, I'm just making sure my brush gets clean. And I'm drying it on my paper towel. And then I'm just going to take my paintbrush and dip it right into my green paint, okay? Let's start. For the L, friends, we are going to go straight down in a line just like that. And we'll go over. Straight line down over for L. Next, I. Next, M. So the M, it goes straight down comes back up, it goes down again, it goes back up. These are all straight lines, no curves, right? And then down. So, so far we have L, I, M, and what's the last letter, friends? E, yes. So let's go down, Straight line at the bottom, straight line in the middle, and straight line on top. Ooh, look friends, we painted an entire word, line. Now we get to paint the actual line. Are you ready? So this is how an entire, a whole line, line looks, right? Before we would cut it, okay? And we're going to paint the outside green. Are you ready? You can start anywhere on your line that you'd like. I'm starting kind of in the on the edge a little bit, somewhat toward the middle, and then I always go back. But you can start wherever you like. Okay, friends? And don't forget to get the edges and go all around. Okay? As you paint, take your time. Right? You don't have to rush. You can just paint with ease and make your painting look just the way you want it. This is your amazing artwork, okay? Here we are as we come down. And then, of course, get as much paint as you need. It's always best to start with a little bit, okay? And then we just keep going. And then we get those parts that are still a little white, if we see that but we can always do that at the end as well. Okay, so we're going to keep going. I need some more paint. <laughs> so I am going to refill my cap with some more paint. All right. 
and I'm going to keep going. All right, how's it going? How does it look? Friends, did you know that a lime tree, right, where we get the limes from, do you know it can be as tall as 16 feet? It can grow 16 feet tall, a lime tree. Isn't that interesting? That's really, really tall, right? Have you ever seen a lime tree before? With a bunch of limes, right, that are green and pretty and super, super sweet and tangy and sour all at the same time. Yep, but a lime is refreshing too, right? If we eat something sticky or gooey or something that we may not like to taste, we can always just have the juice of the lime, right? Or bite down into it. And it kind of takes the taste out of our mouth, right? If we happen to taste something yucky, all right? And we're just going to keep going all around. How's it going for you? Is it going good? Is it going great? I hope it is. <laughs> all right. Okay. I am at the bottom and I'm just going to go around the edges of my lime and get any parts I may have missed. All right, just like that. Okay, there we go. How does your lime look, friends? Do you like it? Isn't that? Awesome. Oh yeah. Look at that lime. Mmm. Right? We remember how a lime tastes. Ooh, a little sour, a little sweet. <laughs> All right, friends. I hope you enjoy painting this. And of course, you can go over it as many times as you would like to. Okay, this is your amazing artwork. I'm going to put my brush away my green paint away. I'm all finished. I'm going to let my painting dry. Do you think I should finish my limes? Ooh, right? It was so sour. <laughs> well, they are good for you. Mm -hmm, they're good to eat and you can use them for so many different things. Well, friends, I hope you enjoyed this time with Miss Shannon. I really enjoyed the time with you. I will see you back tomorrow for our last day of tasting and painting. Yep, that's right. Tomorrow is Thursday and tomorrow we're going to have fun. All right. And taste and paint one more time and it will be our final day of tasting and painting. OK, so I hope you enjoy every type of fruit. I have. It's been super yummy. Until tomorrow, friends, remember, you are awesome, you are intelligent, and you are amazing. Don't forget to tell yourself. Put your hand right here and tell yourself, I am awesome, I am intelligent, and I am amazing. Yep, kiss your beautiful brain right there, just like that. <laughs> and I will see you right back here tomorrow, friends. Have a great rest of your day, okay? And don't forget to send me a picture, okay? I would love to see your artwork. Have a beautiful day, friends. Bye-bye.